how you guys doing welcome in here to rover sports um i wanted to just talk about ducky hodges uh first game as a quarterback in the nfl very interesting prospect out of samford university down in alabama he grew up just north of birmingham 30 minutes away he's a champion duck caller and that's why mike tomlin calls him ducky hodges so um Meanwhile, let's let's look at Devlin Hodges. Um, so this is uh, his first series of the game, taking over for Mason Rudolph, who was brutally hit by Earl Thomas. The NFL came down and they fined him today. But but we're gonna look at uh we're gonna look at Duck Hodges and and I'm gonna tell you my unfiltered opinions about this performance by Duck Hodges and and it would be interesting if Duck played in 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 in, uh, in L.A. or San Diego wherever the Chargers have their minor league soccer stadium and Pittsburgh is a five and a half point underdog to the Chargers but they they should beat the Chargers the Chargers are a terrible team uh, they always choke in the playoffs and. They, uh, they lost to Denver yesterday again. So, meanwhile. Duck with a nice handoff there to uh, Connor. So, Duck, second and three. One read and fire. Get a little holding penalty. Clearly grabbing the back of the jersey. I like the patience, though, by Hodges. He's, the game's not too fast for Hodges. Look at Hodges. Good footwork. Doesn't see anything there. Tries to take a check down that's there. Now, now third and eight. Watch this play against, you know, what, what looks like it's, it's man-to-man coverage. And look at Doug Hodges. There's pressure in his face. He steps up and throws a dime to the sideline. An incredible ball, a wonderful route by Juju Smith Schuster. Schuster, he can't, he can't, he doesn't have any ball security abilities at all. That's why Juju Smith Schuster lost them the game, just like he lost them the Saints game last year, fumbling the football. Lamar Jackson gift wraps you three interceptions and you still can't win a ball game. And Duck Hodges severely outplayed Lamar Jackson but nobody's going to talk about Duck Hodges this is a dime first game Mason Rudolph went to San Francisco he barfed on the field Duck Hodges is a better quarterback than Mason Rudolph and the Steelers should play Duck Hodges I mean look at this against pressure the footwork is perfect he's like a he's like a Gardner Minshew he, he's 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 uh I know that people want to compare him to Mayfield because of the jersey he doesn't necessarily have the arm town of Baker Mayfield but it just shows you like Luke Falk is a is a is a second string quarterback and Duck Hodges is a third string quarterback look at the mobility just look at how athletic he is to make a throw like this the rollout Just totally, totally playing well. Good fake here on the run fake. Hits Vance McDonald. The Steelers then score. There's a lot to see. There's a lot to like. Here Hodges, though, makes a bad decision. He had a couple of really bad decisions. He makes a couple of head-scratching throws like that one. Which, again, you can correct as you go along. Second and four, and th- this, is th- this is the staple of the Steelers' offense, this over route, which is beautiful against a little man-to-man, or it's beautiful against zone coverage. Hodges, pocket, good base on the throwing. Has a little loopy release, but over-the-top delivery, very accurate. The delivery is fine. The guy is totally capable of playing in this league. I don't think he's going to be a superstar in this league. The guy is a capable, capable player.
And then and there you see the arm strength of Hodges. I mean, he throws that a good 50 yards in the air. You know, let's see where he throws this from, the 50. That's pretty good arm strength to get it all the way to the end zone, thrown at 50 yards. So it's not a lead arm strength, but, you know, I think Hodges is, is fine. I think he could be just as good as Rudolph. You got to keep him on the roster. And uh, that, that's just a little quick film review there <coughs> of Duck Hodges. I'm excited about this kid, you know. I'm excited about what I see from Duck Hodges. He has some mobility. He's 6'1". He has adequate height. It's not that hard to play quarterback anymore at the NFL level. He makes dumb throws like that one, though. But that's just from an experience, a full week of preparation. And this guy can end up being a pretty good quarterback. But that, that's a bad throw there. That could be intercepted. If the guy wasn't looking down, um, that could have been a pick six. That just you, you never want to lob it to a running back. That's super, super dangerous there. That's something I would avoid altogether. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I appreciate you all.